Use the reorder feature to manually rearrange the questions and question type sections. Click on the questions menu, then reorder from the menu options. Or click the reorder questions button. The reorder questions window will appear. Click and drag an item, an individual question, question type group, or narrative group by holding down the mouse button while moving it to a new location. Click OK to update the current test. With the scramble option, the program randomly rearranges the questions. To do this, click on the questions menu, then scramble. Choose one or more of the scramble options, sections, questions, or choices. You may assign a new test ID each time you scramble the questions. For example, this could be version B or version C of the same test. When you're done, click OK to scramble the current test. Use the Reorder feature to manually rearrange the questions and question type sections. <clears throat> Use the Reorder feature to manually rearrange the questions and question type sections. Click on the Questions menu, then Reorder from the menu options. Or click the Reorder Questions button. or click the Reorder Questions button. The Reorder Questions window will appear. Click and drag an item, an individual question, question type group, or narrative group by holding down the mouse button while moving it to a new location. Click OK to update the current test. Scramble. <clears throat> With the Scramble option, the program randomly rearranges the questions. To do this, click on the Questions menu, then Scramble. Choose one or more of the Scramble options, Sections, Questions, or Choices. You may assign a new test ID each time you scramble the questions. For example, this could be version B or version C of the same test. When you're done, click OK to scramble the current test. <clears throat> Add style gallery here. This concludes the training video for formatting a test. This concludes the training video for formatting a test.